Hello, I'm Matt, welcome to Badge Workshop. I like to listen to podcasts while I'm working, so I need a speaker for my phone. So let's try and make one. Let's get started. I already had an acoustic speaker, but I bought a new phone and this one won't fit in it, but it's good to have a template to work from. There was a major problem with the old one anyway, and that's that I had to take the case off every time I used it, which is no good when you want to listen to things in the kitchen or the workshop. So for my amplifier, I determined the thickness of the phone with the case on, and then planed some wood down to that thickness. I'm not quite sure what this wood is, but it did used to be a staircase. Anyway, it's going to look nice for this. I'm marking out a slot for the phone to slide into. Then I need to find the speaker and cut a channel for the audio to go through, and then finally come out of the horn. I'm going to make the horn later out of some copper pipe fittings. I do have some headphones with an audio input, and I do use them in the workshop, but sometimes it's just nice to have it on in the background. The trouble is, there's too many great woodworking and making related podcasts, I don't have time to listen to them all. To create the stand for the phone, I'm now going to sandwich this piece I've cut between two other blocks of wood, and glue it all up. You can now see the slot for the phone to slide into, and the channel for the audio to travel through. These bits of wood are all looking very rustic at the moment, but when I trim them up on the table saw, they're going to look fine. I need to mount the stand on a base, so I cut out a piece of wood, and then routed a nice profile around it. I didn't want the stand and the phone to sit on the base at a 90 degree angle. So I adjusted the blade on the saw, and cut a slight angle on the bottom of the dock. While I was here, I trimmed up all the sides, just to clean the wood up a bit. The sound is going to come out from the speaker, through the channel I made, and then into a copper pipe, so I need to drill a hole for the pipe to fit into. The dock just gets attached to the base with some wood glue. Stupidly, when I cut the angle on the dock, I didn't keep the off cup. If I had, I could have then placed it back on top, and it made the whole clamping up process much easier than me messing around trying to do this. To be fair, I am just making this look harder than it is. For the horn, I've got several different plumb fittings. First, some 15mm copper pipe, going to a 15mm elbow, then to a 15 to 20mm reducer, then to a 22 to 48mm. As no water or gas is going through these pipes, I'm not soldering them together, just going to use some epoxy. As you can see, these are so easy to put together. Just a bit of epoxy, and they just slide together and then it just slides onto the base. When the epoxy is dry, I give it all a coat of some Danish oil. Really brings out the colour and will offer some protection. The final step is just to add a few little felt pads as feet. That's it all done. Now I just need to find something better to watch. Thanks for watching and please subscribe for more videos.